What's up y'all, it's Steph and I'm back with another video. If you guys are new here, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you're new and you ain't subscribed yet, check out some of our videos. See if you like us, subscribe to our channel. We have a vlog channel, link is in the description below. We also have a second channel, Steph at Sasha too. Check that out. Today y'all, I'm gonna be doing one of my favorites. Y'all already know. Whenever I get to doing these TikTok viral recipes, I'm in heaven, okay? Because so far, I have not not liked any of them. So today we're gonna finally be doing the Big Mac tacos, y'all. And they look so good. So good and juicy. Okay. Now I know it's normally made with ground beef, so I got that. But y'all know I don't be trying to eat that much beef. So I'ma taste the ground beef one, y'all, but I'ma eat the ground turkey one. So let's get into it. I'm gonna show y'all what I got. I'm gonna make the sauce first, and then we're gonna get to cooking. Are y'all ready? Let's get into the video. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We're gonna eat a little, drink a little. Our story time is the best. Have you L O L when you click play? No, this ain't no clickbait. So, for the sauce, you're gonna need vinegar, relish, onion powder, garlic powder, mustard, mayo, white pepper, and paprika. And then to make the burgers, of course, you need the meat. I'm doing turkey and beef. You're gonna need some salt and pepper, the tortilla shells. These are flour tortilla shells. For your toppings, you want the iceberg lettuce, onions, pickles, American cheese, and I also got some sesame seed. All right, guys, let's make the sauce first so we can let it marinate while we're cooking the tacos. Okay, so you're gonna start with a cup of mayo. Actually, yes, one cup of mayo, one fourth cup of relish. Three tablespoons of mustard. Now I saw people using regular yellow mustard and also like a Dijon. I'm just gonna use yellow. Plain yellow mustard, y'all. Three tablespoons of this. One teaspoon of white vinegar. And then in here I have one teaspoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one and one fourth teaspoons of paprika, and an eighth of a teaspoon of white pepper, okay? And voila, that's it y'all, okay? Mix that up and put it in the refrigerator so it can marinate while your burgers are cooking. I'm really curious about how similar this tastes to Big Mac sauce, you guys, so I'm about to taste it right now. Now, I don't know if it probably has to sit around for a little while for all the flavors to really combine, but I'm gonna taste it right now and let you know. It's good. It's actually really good. I don't think it's exact, but it's good enough, y'all. And it tastes good, so we're going to use this. Maybe it's going to taste exactly like Big Mac sauce in 30 minutes. We'll see. Okay, guys, so while your sauce is marinating, you want to start making the tacos. First thing you want to do is take out your flour tortillas, you guys. I was thinking these were a little bit big, but then now that I'm looking at them more, I, don't, I think they're a perfect size, so I'm not going to cut them down. Just going to leave them like that. Now you want to take your meat, whatever kind of meat you're using. I'm doing ground beef and ground turkey today, and you want to smash it. All the way to the ends, okay? I know it looks big, but it's gonna shrink up, okay? So just smash a nice little thin layer all the way to the ends. Even though it looks thin, that's still a lot of meat, y'all. I think I'm gonna make mine a little thinner. We got the ground turkey. Now, oddly enough, when I was watching different videos, some people didn't even season this, y'all, okay? I'm not about to do that. Okay, I did see some people adding some salt and pepper right now. That's what I'm going to do. So we got pepper. And we got salt. Okay, now, another thing I saw people doing right now is adding onions on top. I'm not going to do that because I don't want my onions to get burnt. So I'm going to cook these and then I'm going to let my onions saute in the, the burger juice for just a little while when I'm done. Okay, so now you just put this meat side down. We're going to cook it for about three minutes on that side. So once it's been cooking for a few minutes, you want to flip it over. I'm going to throw my onions in here. Now it's time to add your cheese and let that melt. Just gonna scoop up my onions from the side and throw that right on top, y'all. Okay, 
Look how much the meat shrank. I really wish I would have made a thinner, bigger piece so it would be more covered, but I think it's pretty good. It's good enough. It's good enough. All right, so now you want to add your toppings. We got lettuce. Pickles. I don't know who thought of this, but I feel like it's going to be good, y'all. What y'all think? Of course, the Big Mac sauce we just made. I don't know how much to put on here. I'll keep some on the side so I can have it during the mukbang. Stay tuned if you want to see me eating and reviewing this, y'all. Because <laughs> I didn't make this for nothing. Okay? And then, I didn't see a lot of people doing this, but I thought this was very clever. Sesame seeds, y'all. Damn, I can't even get it with my nails. Okay, sesame seeds. And we are done. Let's try these out. Come on, y'all. Let's go eat them. Who y'all? Y'all don't know how annoying it is to be trying to do these videos when all you want to do is taste the food, okay? The food been cooked for 15 minutes. I had to set up the camera a different way, set up the lights a different way, do a thumbnail. It's like, girl, just can we just try the food? Can we try the food? Okay, so we're going to get right into the, the uh, beef. Y'all, now I'm a little nervous. I'm hoping this is cooked all the way through. Cause I was looking at it and I was like, it was looking a little red. So hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully it's cooked all the way through. If I was to do this again, I would definitely make, I would smash that meat as thin as I possibly could, y'all. Cause I feel like I'm, I'm no, no matter what, I'm about to have to take a giant bite of meat. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. It looks good. Looks very good. It's a little pink inside, y'all. Mm. It's not bad, though. For those that like, um, like a red burger and all that, you'll be fine with it. Um, for me, I would have liked this to just be all the way done. So I'm going to take a bite from this side. Because I'm scared of that middle. Hmm. 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 Uh. Did I do something wrong, y'all? I feel like I did something wrong. Because people have been ranting and raving about these things. And I'm like, mm. Well, the meat ain't even seasoned good. I think you should definitely season your meat. Like, thoroughly. These people just putting meat. <sighs> I hope this one's cooked, y'all. Don't nobody want a pink turkey burger. That one looks good. This one looks good. Oh. This is my first TikTok fail. I think. Let's see. Let's see about the turkey. Ugh. All right. I ain't gonna even give y'all a bite, y'all, because the beef wasn't that great. All righty, here we go. I mean, it ain't bad, but it ain't good. I don't know. I'm not sure what they're talking about, y'all. I'm confused. <laughs> Did I do mine totally wrong? Where's the cheese? Let me put a pickle up there. I'm so mad. Cause these look so good on everybody else's video. Do I have too much meat? I honestly like the turkey better. Than the, than the beef. Um, but they both need to be seasoned. Like bad. They both really need to be seasoned better. <clears throat> I'm scared to eat the beef one because I see all this pink too. I'm just like, Ugh. okay, so let me take a piece. Right here. Got Big Mac sauce. Mm. 
Mm -mm. I'm not liking that at all. Like, nothing about it. The unseasoned meat, even though I did try to put a little salt and pepper on it, is bad. The mac sauce is not what it's supposed to be at all. Do not follow this recipe I did, y'all. This was a fail. I'm so sorry, guys. So disappointed. My first TikTok viral video fail. I'm going to go look at some more and see what I did wrong. Let me know in the comments what I did wrong. I, this is all wrong. I know they ain't liking this, y'all. I know this is not what people are making and liking it. Okay, so thank you for watching. And what you what what you did get out of the video is what not to do. Okay, at least you got that. Okay, y'all. I hope y'all like the video. Let me know what other TikTok recipes you guys want me to try. You know I love these. These are my favorite. Hit me up at Steph Loves Love, and also give me some challenges to do on Tasha and some pranks, y'all. All right, y'all. If y'all enjoyed the video, thumbs it up. Check out our vlog channel and Steph and Tasha too. Until next time, only your vibes. Peace.